Hey guys, YouTube. This is a uh, hop and others YouTube here. So it's for the um, uh, Bosch Ray Perfect Eco Science Drive uh, WT twenty three seven one three slash sixty nine washing machine. And here with the Siemens iCenter Eco Drive Extra Class uh, um, WM one four two four nine two three slash three two washing machine. And here with the uh, Bosch series four condenser sensor dryer eight kilogram. Um, WTN A two series to do slash one condenser sensor dryer and 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 home of the Siemens I sensor I could try and home of the Siemens I sensor X class uh, a WT WT four six G four nine one G slash twelve nine kilogram condenser sensor dryer and, and home of the Rosa Hob um, RH three VTD a hundred compact two point five kilogram tumble dryer. So yeah, which is a vent time drawer. So yeah. Anyway, so as you can see, we've got a brand new dishwasher here though. But obviously, because of the other one that got broke anyway. I got broke the other time though. But obviously during the, well a few years back ago that we bought, uh, the last time we had the, Bl the Blomberg dishwasher, I think it got broke down anyway, which the model was a GVN 9143 dishwasher which unfortunately to say it got broke down anyway because of um you know i think there's been an issue with the filter and all that so yeah but i think for some reason there's been an issue with the filter etc anyway so yeah i think i think it's because of the water pipe just blocked anyway because i think the filter etc it just it was completely blocked anyway so yeah so as you can see we've now got a brand new dishwasher this time which is the same it's the same make though actually but which it is the same it's the same sort of make though but so yeah so as you can see, ta -da. there is our new dishwasher, which it is a Blomberg, um, as you can see, the model is, as you can see, it is the Blomberg LDV42221, apparently, <coughs> and that one is a fully, in <coughs> and that one is just a fully integrated dishwasher though. So yeah, this is the fully integrated dishwasher, anyway. As you can see, it's got the programs there anyway. And as you can see, inside there, it's got basically the same thing though, but as you can see, it's, as you can see, it's basically got the same thing anyway. And I think on top of it, I think that's where you put your cutlery in there, I think, anyway. I think in there, I think it's where you put your cutlery stuff in anyway, like knives and forks and spoons in. I'm not sure, etc. anyway, but I don't know what that thing is for anyway. So yeah, as you can see, it's got a... Uh, to, it's got one speed thing at the top and then one bit speed thing at the bottom and then I think in there you put um, Kobe in anyway I think in this one you put um, some knives and forks and spoons cutlery anyway and I think with that one you put some sharp cutlery and um, cutlery I think like sharp knives and all that so anyways, as you can see inside it there's the filter there's the filter you can see inside there anyway. As you can see, that thing, that's the part of the filter that's inside anyway. And just you can see, I think it's, it's exactly the same as what it was on the uh, GVN 914 e, A3E dishwasher anyway. Um, I don't know what to do with that anyway, but I think with that one you used to turn anyway. And that one is probably more like, <coughs> The way you put water inside it, I think that one is the way you put uh, that one up here. I think that's where that's that's the filling up stage. I think anyway. I think that one is the filling up stage anyway. Um, yeah. No, that but you can't get. I don't think that but you can't get out anyway. I think we used to pull the thing now, like it was in the G three N. Not one for e a three e dishwasher. I think we used to pull that with that. I don't know. I can't remember what was the time anyway. So yeah. <coughs> so as you can see, this is all brand new anyway. So anyway, and then just in here, this is where you put your dishwasher tabs in. I don't know what that bit is anyway, but I haven't got a clue what that bit is, that bit is anyway. I think that bit you close it. I think. Oh yeah, I don't know Yeah, that one you probably can't do anyway, but 
There you go, it closed itself in. This is where you put your dishwasher taps in anyway, which I think we still got anyway. And then, open, and then from there you close it. Yeah, that bit you got to close anyway, as you can see, with just the thing there, and then to open it, it opens it, it opens it back up anyway. So yeah, but obviously this has been a while since I've not filmed dishwashers anyway, from many years ago. So yeah, I don't know what that bit side is anyway. I think this one is more like the drying van, etc. I think that one in there, I think that's the drying van. Anyway, so anyway, as you can see, we've got the programs and the cycles there anyway. And yeah, there we go, nice shiny, nice shiny display of it anyway. <clears throat> I don't know what F1 and F2 and F3 and F4 is anyway, but you know. So anyway, so numbers, anyway. Hold on, yeah, it's got the programs there anyway. So okay, so number zero is the Pro Clean, which I don't know what that does anyway. I think that takes for about one hour, one hour fifty minutes anyway. Obviously, you can't set any options with that anyway. <coughs> I think the F1, the F2, and the F3, and the F4 is the options anyway, and then you got the uh, time of display there as well anyway. So number zero, which is the Pro Clean apparently, but this is where it does the Auto Clean anyway. Especially when there's nothing in it. Um, program one is the Eco 50 degrees. Um, that one, I think, you, yeah, that one you can probably set the timer anyway, which is the F1 and the F2. I think the F1, I think, is the, I don't know what you call that anyway. <coughs> and then, yeah, and then that one is probably more like the drawing side anyway. So, yeah. Which obviously it cuts down to, like, you know. So yeah, the F1 is just 257 and then the F2 is 1 hour 55 minutes, anyway, which that takes quicker than that anyway. <coughs> the F3 is it's basically 1 hour 13 minutes, it's, one hour, it's 4 hours and 13 on this one. And then the F4 is just 3 hours and 6 minutes anyway. But I think the F3 one is even, it's even longer than 3 hours and 43 minutes anyway, but this one is 4 hours and 13 anyway. Whereas that is 3006 anyway on the F4. So, anyway, program two is the auto 40 degrees to 65 degrees. Which that one it takes <coughs> up to three hours, you know, which that one takes up to three hours anyway. But again, you can't set any options. Or you can set the options on the F3, I think. That one takes about 3 hours and 26. Yeah, it's just the F3, you can probably set that anyway. Because I think yeah, the F3 options is is available on the uh, auto 40 degrees and 65 degrees on the P2. Program three is the intensive 70 degrees, which I think the that was the cycle that we did use. I think the intensive 70 degrees that was the one we did on the the other Blumber, which is the GVN, which I think it was the GVN 913E dishwasher. That was a program that we use sometimes anyway. The intensive 70 degrees anyway. So that's 228 minutes. <coughs> F1 is 1 on 56 and F2 is 1 on 45 minutes <coughs> on that. And the F3 is 244 minutes. The F4 is 306 minutes on that, which you have 306 minutes is, 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 is longer than that anyway. It's now longer than F3 anyway. So yeah, that's program three, which is the intensive 70 degrees. The program four is the express dry 60 degrees, which that one, which that one, which, which most of the cycle we use is on that anyway. So yeah, program four is the express dry 60 degrees, <coughs> which um, that one we tend to use anyway, which that cycle we tend to use most of the time is the express dry 60 minutes. <laughs> Which that takes to up, <coughs> which that just takes up to a quicker wash stage anyway, which is the 58 minutes. You know, the 58 minutes is quicker anyway, which that was the program that we used to use on the Blomberg uh, GVN 914 A3E dishwasher, which that was a cycle we, we used anyway. But I think it was the Express one we did anyway. But on that one, you can't set any options on the F1 or the F2. 
on the F3 you can anyway. <clears throat> on the F3 it takes to about 129 minutes. And yeah, it's just it's just the only option you get on the F3 really anyway. Which this one this one's about 58 minute cycle. And the F3 is 129 minutes anyway. Program 5 is the quick wash 35 degrees, which that one takes to up to about 30 minutes anyway. But that's the 30 minute quick wash anyway. More long, it's more quicker than, than the express drive 60 degrees anyway. <coughs> Again, you can't set any options. But you can set, oh, that one takes to about 1 hour 50 minutes. That does on the F3. And yeah, and same again, you can't use any options on the F1 and F2 and F4, but you can use it on the F3. So yeah. Program 6 is the pre-wash. Program 6 is pre-wash, which that one only takes to up to about 50 minutes. But you can't set any options. And you can't set the options on the F3, F4 as well. So on the pre-wash stage, you can't set any options because the options are not available on pre-wash. So yeah, oh here we go, um, F1 is the half load and F2 is a rapid clean, F3 is super glass and F4 is tray clean. So yeah, obviously there's only about six programs you get on the dishwasher anyway. So I just didn't know there was options on this one anyway, but I just didn't exactly see that. So F1, P1 is eco 50 degrees, you can select half load, rapid clean, and on the F3 is super, super glass, super gloss. F4 is tray clean, you can set. Okay. I just don't know you can set all that options anyway. Okay, so Pro and 2 is the auto 40 degrees and 65. Can't set options on that. F3 is the super gloss, you can set, you can set the super gloss option. 3 is intensive 10 degrees. You can set half load, rapid, rapid clean, which is 1 hour 45 minutes. Rapid clean is 1 hour 45 minutes anyway, which that's a quicker cycle, more like time saver. And on that you can set super gloss and tray clean as well. Pro and 4 is the, is the express dry 60 degrees. With that you can set out three, which is the super gloss. So, yeah. And on program five is, and then on program five is the quick wash, thirty-five degrees. Can't see any options, but that you can select super gloss, F three. Uh, yes, I think the F, the F options. I think these, these are the options anyway. And on program six is the pre-wash, but again, you can't see any options. None of the options are available on, on the pre-wash anyway. And then just on here, you got the time. You got the time of delay. Oh, you probably can hold it anyway. See how long that goes up to. So on this one, it is a 24 hour delay though. It's a 24 hour delay on this one. On this one, it is a 24 hour delay on this one. It's only about a 24 hour delay on this one. So I'll demonstrate for you anyway, and we're here to start. So, yeah. There we go. And just you can see in, inside here, so there's the light, it's the red light inside it anyway. So you just you can see inside it, there's the light anyway, which that connects it on to the dishwasher anyway. There it is, that's the light there, you can see in the back. It's a bit hard to see though, you can see that's the light extension that connects it anyway. Quite a quiet dishwasher though, but you know, this dishwasher is so quiet. See how it demonstrates anyway. Especially you've got the fitting up stage anyway. That's the fitting up stage anyway, I believe. Hopefully we will we'll be doing some videos of that, hopefully. It might be able to go back and do some videos of that, hopefully, of the um, Blondo dishwasher, but which I don't know when we're gonna do. Pay for the meantime, we might do it anyway, but I don't know when. Hopefully we might be able to film some, hopefully. So yeah, hopefully you might be able to film one, hopefully. So yeah.
that's the filling up stage, you know, this is where it's filling up. This is where we just put it on a pre-wash stage anyway. You can hear it as the filling up stage is quite quiet anyway. It's even quieter than the um, Blomberg, the other Blomberg that we previously had was the GFN 94A3 dishwasher. Which I think that one, that didn't have a light in there anyway, but that one didn't have a light anyway. Which the other Blomberg dishwasher, that, that didn't have a Phoenix either anyway, as you can see. It's just, you can see it's got, there we go, it stopped filling now. Well, it's, it's even noisy though, but... Well, you can see that though. That goes on 12 minutes anyway. Right. I had to do that. There we go, now it's drain anyway. I think to do that you have to hold it for three seconds anyway. Because I think it was on one minute anyway. Now it's good, let's see how the beeping demonstration goes anyway. I may not be able to see it because it's probably harder than that. It's probably hard to see anyway. Yeah, it's probably hard to see the display in there. And see what the beeping noise looks like on this. I'm sure it does have a beeping noise. There we go. There we go, look. That's the beeping noise. There we go. Switch it off, off now, anyway. So, yeah, I thought this would be the demonstration of this Blumberg dishwasher, anyway. But it looks very new to me though, but you know, it looks very new, especially there's nothing in it though. But hopefully, you know, I think, yeah, hopefully we might be able to put some cutlery in there, especially in plates and you know, hopefully, especially when there's dirty stuff in it. So yeah. But as you can see, <coughs> in there, that's the dishwasher tabs anyway. So yeah, that's the dishwasher tabs anyway, because that's in there anyway. That's the dishwasher tabs. Which we've got the um, W5 dishwasher capsules anyway. Which obviously, you know, so yeah, that's the dishwasher cap, cap, cap drawers anyway, which that's what we use for the dishwasher anyway. So yeah. So yeah, that's just a quick uh, demonstration the overview of this Blomberg um, LDV42221, apparently. And basically that's the uh, class one dishwasher anyway, and that is the fully integrated dishwasher that is anyway. But obviously it's the same on the, um, the other dishwasher anyway. I think the other one is a fully integrated as well anyway, so yeah. But as you can see, this is quite new anyway, but this dishwasher, that's just came from, uh, it's basically from Euronics anyway. So this dishwasher, that's just came from Euronics, I believe, anyway. Because for some reason, this dishwasher, that's just came from, that's just came from Euronics anyway. Which, we obviously, we bought this dishwasher from Euronics anyway. So yeah, which technically I haven't been to Euronics washing machine shop uh, like this year though, but I don't know when I'll be going back to do some videos of the the washing machine shop appliances like Curry's washing machine, like Curry's new one next to the British Heart Foundation. So yeah, but obviously this dishwasher looks very new to me though. It's brand new anyway, but quite a lot of the uh, quite a lot of the design of it anyway, especially the design of the display as well anyway, and the programs and the options on it as well. But whereas on the other one, whereas on the other Blomberg, the, the previous one, that didn't have any options anyway. But this one's got options anyway, which is the F1, F2, M3 and F4. So yeah, this one you can put your set options anyway. So yeah, whether on the other one you can't anyway. <clears throat> I think on the other one I think I think it does have options but I can't remember. So yeah. But anyway, 
hope you guys enjoy watching this video and yeah and don't forget to like comment me on YouTube and all that comment me below on YouTube and just comment me and so yeah anyway I hope you guys enjoy watching this video and yeah I know if you would probably do some more I hope you might be able to do some videos of it hopefully anytime soon we might be able to do some videos of the dishwasher anytime so yeah anyway thank you very much for watching and Hopping down between YouTube at all times and see you guys later. Goodbye.